scientific reasons why Hindus visit temples. Ever wonder why we visit temples often? Is it simply to fulfill our desires or to please our elders? In reality, visiting a temple actually does a world of good to us. Here are 10 scientific reasons to help you understand the real meaning of visiting temples as per Hindu Puranas. Location and structure of a temple. Temples don't just crop up anywhere. There is a sound reasoning to it as temples are mostly found in places where there is abundance of positive energy, a free flow of the electric and magnetic waves traveling through north and south. Moolasthan or Garbha Griha. The idol is always placed in the core of the temple, that is, in the center, which is known as the Garbha Griha or Moolasthan. Mostly, the structure of the temple is built after the idol of the residing deity is placed in the positive centric place within the temple. This is important as it is said that at the Moolasthan, the earth's magnetic waves are known to be extreme. Why you need to leave your footwear outside the temple? In the ancient times, the floor of the temple was known to be a good conductor of the positive energy and this energy would pass on to devotees through their feet. Hence, it was important to enter the temple bare feet. Activating all five senses in the temple. There are five important senses in the human body. The sense of sound, touch, hearing, taste and smell. All these are activated when one visits the temples. Sense of hearing. When the bell is rung, it emits a sound that creates a unity in the right and left side of the brain. Apparently, the sound emitted lasts with us for at least 7 seconds in the form of an echo. These 7 seconds are enough to activate all the 7 healing centers in the body. Sense of Sight When a devotee closes his or her eyes to pray and open it, they see the camphor for the arti. This is the only light that is seen in the dark and therefore it activates the sense of sight. Sense of touch. Our hands are warm after we take the arti and then when we touch our eyes, this warmth ensures that our sense of touch is activated. Sense of smell. The combination of flowers, camphor, incenses, sticks, etc create a strong essence and activate the sense of smell. Sense of taste. This Charnamrath is kept in a copper vessel. According to Ayurveda, water from a copper vessel helps balance the three doshas in the body. It also activates your sense of taste. Performing the Parikrama. A Parikrama around the temple is a must. This should be done at least 8 to 9 times in the clockwise direction. This is because it is believed that while doing the Parikrama, we can absorb all the positive energies.